Sure, you can create images using AI, but if you want to include text, you'll get this kind of stuff. It's very, very poor, or it used to be. Wait till you see this. So go to Google and search for Ideogram AI. You click here. This is completely free. And you have the generate bar here and the different settings. So we're just going to change now the ratio. And yes, we want 1.0, the latest version. And we're going to put in our prompt, duck holding a post-it which says, I am a duck. And you have all these different formats now that you can use. But I suppose if you did this with other AI, like Midjourney or Dali, those always struggle with words. Check this out, though. So it's coming in now, black and white, not for long. So there you go, four ducks. So let's have a look at the output. Not too bad. I am a duck. That's definitely there. And the rest. This cute fella here. Yeah, holding a post-it, I am a duck. And go to this guy here. So he's up in a fence, I am a duck. No, oh, look at the, the hand, fingers, really. So we won't use that one anyway. The warning is off. But you'll notice there, you can copy the image. Uh, you can put that into your pictures folder for whatever you want to use it. But there are so many possibilities around this. Let's try another prompt. Pink ball with a sign that says, kick me. And you get four of those. Yeah, pink ball, kick me. And let's try another one. But it is so easy to use. And to try to think of something here. Yes, elf holding neon sign saying, read more now. And there you go. So we have a green elf, read more now, with her neon sign. What about this guy? Mm, he's a bit sinister. Won't use him. This looks like a nice, a nice happy-go-lucky fellow. So there you go. That is Ideogram AI. It's excellent. So it's free to try out. It is producing amazing results. Now they're not all perfect. You have to go through them and uh, pick what you want to use, but certainly worth the go. And I'll uh, show you here some of the other outputs that uh, it has done for me. Uh, you can have great fun with it, but can also be used in your in your classroom. All right, give it a spin.